view a report of unbilled billable expenses by project. So we'll do that by going to the project section and generate invoices. Here we can sort invoices by customer or project. So let's do it by project. If we want, we can filter to the specific project or see all of them. We also have lots of filter choices uh, and display options, whether we want time entries and other things. And then we have two options. We can do a preview, the actual bill, or do a pre-bill report. Let's take a look at both. Pre-bill report here shows three vendor invoices. So these are purchase orders that have been converted to uh, vendor bills or vendor invoices. And we can see the total for this project that needs to be billed is 68,500. If we want, we can start over and actually convert this into an invoice. So let's go to this one project. Let's go to preview. We can take a look at what we want to bill. Let's say we want to un we don't want to build this one yet. We could, but let's bill it. Got our descriptions over here. And if we had other transactions, whether we had uh, employee reimbursement expense reports, accounts payable bills, or other things, we could bill those as well, or just credit card transactions, etc. We go ahead and create the invoice. Invoice was successfully created, and we could also do that in in batch. If we go on over to uh, order entry now and to sales invoices, we'll see it. It's right here. Here is the invoice. And if we want to take a look at it, and all these invoice templates can be customized, but we can take a look at the default out of the system. And we can see that here is an invoice for uh, these amounts. And of course, these document templates can be customized to look pretty for your business.